who simply took the points from his rival Matthew Knights. Time now for the presentations. Let's go down to Craig Willis. Ladies and gentlemen, would you please welcome the president of the Victorian Return and Services League, Vietnam veteran Major General David McLaughlin, to present the Anzac Day medal to the player whose conduct and play during the game best exemplifies the Anzac spirit of skill, courage in adversity, self-sacrifice, teamwork and fair play. David, the winner is... The Anzac Day medal for 2010 goes to the Collingwood player, Scott Pendlebury. Um, I'd just like firstly thank Essendon um, and to our boys, well done, well played. Um, we fought the game out really well, um, and let's just keep going. Have a good year, and thank thank everyone for turning up today. It's a great game. Well done, Scott Pendlebury, winner of the Anzac medal. I'm now going to invite Collingwood captain Nick Maxwell and coach Mick Malthouse to come forward to accept the Anzac trophy. First of all, just want to thank uh, the AFL and Essendon for making this possible today. We understand we're very privileged to play on a day such as this. It's an important day in Australia's history, and uh, we're very grateful. And of course, I want to thank this wonderful crowd for coming in every year. We appreciate all your support. Well done to Mick and Nick and the Collingwood Football Club and thank you to Essendon. Thank you to more than 90,000 of you who made such a wonderful day, Anzac Day 2010 here at the MCG. Well done Craig Willis.